Welcome back everyone. Let us go through the pros and cons of having a Labrador Retriever, the number one breed in the world. But before that, do not forget to hit the like and share buttons and do subscribe to the channel for more. Let us have a look at the pros of a Labrador Retriever. Number 1. Labrador Retrievers are dependable and sociable canines. Labrador Retrievers tend to be sweet and content most of the time, but every breed is susceptible to individual dogs developing the disorders that might create instability in their personalities, their moods and their behavior behaviors. They emotionally connect with people when making excellent supportive animals. When you live with one, practically every day will bring a grin to your face. You'll always have a buddy and if you do not mind taking time out with them to play, whether it's in the backyard or even it's in the beach. Number 2. These canines are really patient. If they believe it will be fun, Labrador Retrievers will put up the practically for anything. They'll get nicely along with children since they do not respond negativity to their tail pulling for yanking or even ear clutching antics. This breed will be forever grateful for a space to call their own if you provide a bed next to your favorite chair or even the fireplace. These canines are open-minded and will engage in horseplay or the calm afternoon or try out new activities with their dear ones. Their personalities evolve to play complementary roles with your family which is why kids consistently seem to fit in with them. Number 3. Training a Labrador Retriever is a breeze. One of the smartest breeds in the world you can find today is this one. They are simple to train since they like meeting new owners and demands. Anyone who wishes to have a Labrador Retriever as a buddy must be able to play fetch. It tends to be a healthier connection between you if you are working together in life rather than always instructing the dog what to do, even though they are intelligent and can occasionally lead them into trouble, especially if they find out how to open the refrigerator door. Funny, isn't it? Treats work well for teaching new behavior in Labrador Retrievers because of the great food incentive. Given that, weight-related issues might materialize suddenly when you should exercise caution when providing a figure. Number 4. As much as they love you, this breed adores the sea. These boisterous canines like swimming. You'll have a pup swimming all day if there is water around them to locate. Most of them are well-mannered this going to the beach is frequently the finest destination for the species. Another excellent choice to think about a dog park is with a pool where they may run about unstrained. Since they have a lot of energy, swimming can help them to exhaust as they have not to engage in damaging boredom behaviors when you arrive home. Number 5. In general, Labrador Retrievers are healthy canines. From a gentle standpoint, this breed is in typically good health. Breeders that are responsible will test for conditions like elbow and hip dyslexia. This breed is occasionally prone to eye issues, muscular weakness and heart diseases. Exercises induced collapse is another symptom that some young people may experience. These small problems can be identified by a direct vet examination. In order to make sure that most of the typical health issues aren't present for them and that you can create a treatment plan for them, you should inquire about a hip, an elbow and an eye test. To remove the risk of an unexpected collapse, you might also want to think about getting an EIC and a DNA test. Well, you have to take care of your dog, you can deny that. Their velvety lips make them feel idle for luring. That's number 6. Earlier generations of this breed were carefully developed to promote the retrieving different types of prey when hunting. They have remarkable tracking skills which enables them to catch ducks and other birds without harming them so that they might be used as food. It is safer and simpler to educate these dogs not to bite since they have tendency of not biting during all types of play. Even if they feel threatened, damaging blows are typically infrequent. Shocked? Well, this is very shocking. Number 7. Having a Labrador Retriever is usually not a problem due to size. A good boy or even a girl 
Labrador Retriever will live with you practically any place unless you are a renter and the size limit for a dog is 40 pounds or even less. The most obstinate landlords are typically won over their canine personalities as well. The only other factor to take into account while having a Labrador Retriever is that you likely have to pay a greater security deposit and more rent if you lease one. This breed intentionally is uncontrollably enormous nor as they are so little nor are they concerned about what may happen if they accidentally step on you. Even though only half of them can fit on a lap at once, they also form the idle pet. Ideally at the end of that hug, you'll find him smiling and wagging his tail. Cute, is not it? Number 8. Labradors are intelligent thief detectors. Not every dog will begin sitting within 5 minutes of receiving the sit command. The Labrador will though. This is due to the Labradors are ranked 7th among all dogs in the stress list of the canine intelligence and are grouped with the brightest dogs. Here's what that implies in the list. Less than 5 repetitions of a command are all that is required for them to learn. As a result, your lab will be simple to housebreak and pick up commands very easily. You can easily rely on them to safeguard your house and your loved one, even your dear babies. They can easily detect the presence of burglars and intruders faster than any other breed. Dog intelligence won't be used as an issue for them. According to the experts, more than 95% of the time, Labrador will accept orders when they're given for the first time. Well, that's for the type of pros that we were looking for, so let's go ahead for the cons. Number 1. Labrador Retrievers retain their young traits for a long period. Although Labradors are adorable puppies with the ability to sway people's emotions with a single glance, they also retain their youthful characteristics until the age of 4. This implies that if your dog exhibits significant levels of separation anxiety or boredom at home during the day, you may have a lot of chewing issues at your hands. Yep, that's true. To protect your furnishing houses from damaging during the crucial puppy years, make sure there are some amusement alternatives accessible, like toys and other cute things. Number 2. This breed has a serious issue with shedding. The thicker winter court that Labrador Retrievers develop like to emerge in the late spring. This implies that when you need the comb to cut off the coat of this breed, the fur will start flying everywhere. There are occasionally when removed enough of it at the time, the dog gives you impression that you could raise a brand new litter of the puppies from the scraps. It won't be too awful in most of the households if you keep aware of this drawback. Hardwood floored homes are usually exceptions. The Labrador Retrievers fund tend to collect in the corners and around the borders of your wall. Cleaning should be done on a daily basis to preserve the healthy atmosphere and you should give them frequent nail trimmings and twice weekly dental cleanings. Yep, that's a lot of work, but you have to do it. Can't deny that. Number 3. Labrador Retrievers are not the best choice if you want a security dog. Labrador Retrievers first guard their possessions and humans, and when they see that there is a different person at the door, their entire demeanor changes. Most of these canines are too friendly to serve as security dogs because of this. They have a strong reputation for being amiable that they get along with some of the world's largest creatures, including even elephants. Shocked? Imagine a dog with an elephant. Number 4. Labrador Retrievers require assistance with their dietary practices. There is a lot of vitality in this breed and as a result, their natural inclination is to consume a large amount of food each day to meet their energy needs. If you don't take your dog for a few walks daily, some of the fun in a weeks, obesity may develop into an issue that you'll need to deal with. Imagine yourself carrying a huge dog in your lap. Most members of this breed lack the self-control to quit eating. This drawback may also lead to a turmoil at the meal time since Labradors frequently attempt to scavenge food from the other members of the group. To find out how much food you need, it may be beneficial to consult with your vet. Number 5. With this breed, you ought to provide your dog with high quality food. The diet must be into account that a dog's high energy requirements as well as your living choices whether you buy commercial food or create it yourself. The less costly foods that don't provide complex dietary requirements don't work well with Labrador Retrievers, who frequently overindulge to them in to obtain the necessary nutrients. To find out what human foods are okay for them to eat and which should be steer clear of your site for the vet. Number 6. The Labrador Retrievers require early social link. Expose your new puppy to a range of various locations, the circumstances, the people and the animals between the ages of and to enhance your border with the Labrador. Early obedience training will aid in shaping your personality into a sociable, devoted friend. 
the base intellect may start to work against you if you don't get the chance to meet this demand. By socializing, dogs lose their desire to please people. It is not uncommon for an isolated Labrador to develop an introvert personality instead of being an extrovert person. This process can also result in hyperactive behaviors and an elevated risk of damage when left to their own devices. Number 7. With this breed, costs need to be taken into account. The price of ownership from a reputable breeder may be quite costly due to the popularity of Labradors, particularly in the United States. A single properly documented puppy typically may cost 1500s or even more. The price of may triple if the dog possesses championship traits. The price might increase to five figures if one of the parents has led success in those shows. Adopting a Labrador Retriever from a rescue group or a neighborhood shelter is one of the methods to overcome this drawback. Due to their popularity, you'll still need to pay from $300 to $500, but much of these amicable gents and ladies will easily fit at your new residence. You'll also need to plan for an average yearly expense of $1,000 that comes with both alternatives. Imagine spending that much money for a dog. Number 8. A Labrador Retriever may get into a lot of trouble because of its curiosity. Labrador Retrievers may explore a heart and a large garden is unquestionably advantageous if you're considering getting into it this breed. This will begin to be noticed what is happening in the world around them if you leave them unintended for an extended period of time. This will follow their interest in unforeseen paths that you might not even think about. Your dog will find a way to make things happen if there's a hole in your fence, a functional lock on the gate, or a garden without any holes at all. Digging tendencies are also a significant issue with this breed in addition to chewing. You should consider this issue if you have a soft terrain and a fence that suggests a potential escape. Well, thanks for watching. Hope you've liked this video. Stay tuned with us for more.